question is, do these two uh, superpowers end up in a hot war? Because one of the lessons of Cold War I is that you can go from cold to hot war quite quickly. George Orwell first used the term Cold War in 1945. Uh, it took many years uh, in the remainder of that decade to convince Americans that they were in a Cold War. And then in 1950, North Korea invaded South Korea and a hot war began. The big concern in my mind is that uh, on the issue of Taiwan, the United States and China appear to be on some kind of collision course because Xi Jinping says that Taiwan should be under the direct control of the Chinese Communist Party and its de facto autonomy and democracy have to go. And the United States says that the status quo in Taiwan cannot be altered by force. Uh, and that is a dangerous state of affairs because in the past, the United States could deter China from acting simply by sending a couple of aircraft carriers. Now, if the US were to send aircraft carriers to the Taiwan Strait, there's a risk that the Chinese could sink them uh, with land-based missiles.